Here we go. Sanyo eco ju ju. Sanyo eco tops tops. Sanyo is just the job for you. Sanyo ni top of the pops. Oh my! <laughs> Any of you remember that phrase? That was a 20-year running show. Imagine that. Back in the day, the man I'm about to speak to has been in this business since 1975. Do the math. He's in his 40th year. Guess what? He says he's still having fun. His show on Citizen Radio on weekends, three hours on Saturdays and Sundays is the highest rated on radio. You know the show. Rocker Rocker. In short, he calls himself, has been calling himself, the blackest man in all of black Africa. You know him better simply as Fred Obachi Machoka. He's my guest on Inspiration Thursday. JKL begins right now. I love it when some people have been in this business for 40 years and still loving it. That means there's a lot of hope for many of us out there. But I tell you, this man, what a man. Start tweeting at Fredo Machoka. My Twitter handle is at Queen Anger Jeff. The hashtag is simply JKL or Roga Roga or whatever you want to call it because the man himself is a living legend. Fred. Yep. What a man. My man. And what a voice. No problem. <laughs> Anytime. <laughs> and you know, any uh, place. Anywhere. Anywhere. But Fred, for a man, and many people don't know this, a man who started off in the GSU. Yes. You were part of the police wing. Yes. In fact, somebody call Recky Squad yes. right now. Yes. No problem. That's how you and, started. And, and we'll be able to sort it out. <laughs> <laughs> Did you know what you wanted to do, Fred, when you were at the GSU? No, sir. I didn't know what I wanted to do, and I don't think many young people know what they want to do. Yeah. They just want to do something, and I found something to do. What was the break, Fred? Uh, oh, before the break, you can read Morse code. Yes. You can da, read... Da, da, da. Mm-hmm. Come on. That's Q. <laughs> what is that? There's QRV means I'm ready. QRV. Yes. Hello. That's right. And you can read. I, I can. I can. I can read. You know those perforated holes when uh, you're transmitting using telex. Telex. Or a teleprinter, yes. as it was known. I can read that. I can also read using light, with a torch. If you are about hundred meters away in the dark, I can communicate. If you understand my language, mm -hmm. I can communicate with you using a torch. And I will be able to tell you, we are with Jeff Koinange. Come on. And this guy is damn dangerous. Smoky. <laughs> <laughs> Fred, you know, half the audience doesn't even know what you're talking about. You know that. No problem. Moscow, Telex, yes, yes. Uh, Torch. Uh, and what were digital. That is all coded. That is safety. Wow. When did the first For break, you. When did the first brick break come, Fred? Uh, in broadcasting? Mm. Way back in 1975. Yes, I was uh, given a chance to do just a small segment within Sanyo Ju Sanyo Top's radio show, then being hosted by the late Saido Marika Songo and Mohammed Rama. And then after that is history. The rest, as they say. Yes, till today. My yeah. huh? There we are. That was tw you did that for 20 years? Yes, I did that show for 20 years. And there were and, other... Uh, yeah. Even when uh, there was a coup d'etat yes. and uh, the go-downs for Sanyo radios and Sanyo electronic equipment was looted, the Japanese did not want to suspend the advertising because that was the hottest advertising forum or platform they had. So we continued advertising that people buy Sanyo radios, Sanyo cassette recorders, Sanyo, everything, yes. without having the products. We were waiting for the next consignment from Japan. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. Man. Yeah. Man. 
Did you know you had it, Fred, all along? Did you know you had the voice, the presence, the ability? I really didn't know. And uh, I am still not so sure. Because uh, each day I learn from my audience. They tell me something. 40% of what they tell me sometimes is useless. In fact, sometimes 80%. And I, I pick, I extract just about 20% and I run with it because they have educated me so much. I was about to say that, Fred. Yes. Even you, now you're in your 60s, you're yes. still learning. Yes. You're still taking advice. Yes. Unlike people who are in their 20s, wamefikiri wamefika. Wamefika kabla ya kwanza. You don't arrive before yeah. you start your journey. Yes. Yeah. You don't talk about a guy being a superstar, a guy. Yes. I see it in the papers mm. all the time mm. that this is the man known or woman known, famous for. These are, the, these are the pioneers of pop and stuff. And when you check it out, they have been in the public eye for four years. Four years, Chief. Mm. Four years. Yeah. You haven't started. No. No. You have no, no idea. No. No. That's why we, we, we respect people we respect people like Dolly Parton who have been at it since eternity. Yeah. And Kenny still, Rogers. And still going. And still going. Still singing yeah. gambler, so, you know. So, so I think it is important to be aware that it takes a lot of hard work yeah. but above all God's blessings to get to to, to last and in the industry. And you've done incredibly well, Fred, because there was another show you used to do and you, uh, very close to your heart, something about Lukozade. Yes, 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 yes. What was the name? Lukozade. Ogua Polena Lukozade. Yes. Sponsored by GSK. Mm -hmm. I did that for over 11 years. And each week you would go to a hospital uh, and actually present some Lukozade to some patients. A bottle of Lukozade, yeah. a get well card, and an opportunity for the patient to send greetings to their loved ones. You know when you are in hospital, Jeff, have you ever been to hospital? Two places, Touch wood, no. two places where you become a commoner, if that is the correct word, yes. you know? Kizungu changu ni kidogo. So take it easy if I goof. Yeah. In a hospital, you wear a uniform, just like they wear uniform in jail because you are a commoner, you are a, an ordinary person. Mm. And so you are isolated from your loved ones and there are people who go to hospital and never get anybody to visit them. So I used, to, I used it to visit those people and give them an opportunity to communicate with their loved ones and I think I did a pretty good job. You did that. indeed, you inspired a lot of mm -hmm. people, Fred. I mean, nurses would, would leave their classes and come and Listen to and you. there are people watching JL, yes. JKL yes. tonight. Millions. Okay? Millions. Whom I visited when they were born. You know, the day they dropped on earth. Okay, I was there with a bottle of leukocyte for mama. And they are there out now watching. Probably in a, in a, in a nice cozy room. <laughs> because they work. Yes, yes. Okay? Yeah. That was way back in... Uh, 80, 81. Right. How old are they today? Oh, they've got to be 30s. 30s. They could be working. Fred, did you work with the other greats? Like, we used to listen to a show on the weekend with Mahanja Makadara Mike. Mahanja Makadara Mike and Easy Leasy. Easy Leasy. <laughs> the Dallas boy. That was good. Yeah. You know, that was way back, I think, 70s well, or 70s, 80s. 70s. When uh, Kazungu Katana Joseph. Yes. KK, KK. Senda Wakoyera, the man, Oof. Abdul Haq, the, the boy with the longest queue in town. Longest queue in town. You understand? Mm. And Tiny Obongo Jr. <laughs> and yes. little Catherine Kasabule out of Ngara High School, I think at that time, looking real pretty. Even back yeah. then. And there were others, Lenny Mwashegwa. Lenny Mwashegwa. Remember that? Late date. Uh, and, and, yes. Right. And... and, and uh, and uh, who, whom have I, have I forgotten, you know? Mm. Sundowner, uh, yeah. there was... Yeah, um, Mikindishu, oh. uh, uh, and uh, yeah. who else? Yeah. Josfa Tengige, mm. you know, those, those guys. Yeah. And, and of course... Uh, uh, Don't worry. Tweet at Fred Omachoka, at Kananga Jeff. Let us know 
those names we are forgetting from yes. back in the day. I'm sure Great. people remember. Oh, yes. I'm sure people remember. Jojo Pio. Jojo Pio. Oh, those guys oh, who are man. smoking. <laughs> now you could, you could have <laughs> had <laughs> to come with two of those. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah. it, it was great days, man. It was those, great times. Those were good. And then in the Swahili service now with people. Okay, I've, I was also forgetting Sam Madoka. Oh, the mighty yeah. Smex. Smex. The mighty Smex. Ooh. And, uh, it was heavy. Yeah, and then, of course, there was Saidi Ali Matano. You know, there was uh, there was yeah. uh, 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 Hadija Ali. You know. Uh, and the people so, like Jueri Omari, let's, Aisha, come, let's come back Aisha to Catherine. Muhammad. Let's come back to Catherine Kasabuli. Yes. You said she was a little e teenager. Out Pretty of girl. Out of school and doing some uh, uh, DJing uh, at Voice of Kenya General Service. Yes. And uh, I remember one, one day I heard her on, on radio and I said, this is a good voice. And I took her to do a commercial for me for Lucas uh, for Cerelac. I was the first person to put vo uh, 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 Catherine Casavule's voice on television. Voice. Yes. The face came later. Wow. Yes. Come on. Yeah. She did a commercial for Cerelac. And every time I meet Catherine, yes. she says, "I remember you. You tortured me, you fellow." <laughs> and I ask why. Then she said, yeah. you told me that I'm selling baby food and not coffins, so I should smile. Uh -huh. Yes. So I remember. Even though you're on radio, still yes. smile. Yes. Wow. Because people will know you are smiling, cool. even on radio. Yes. Mm -hmm. You also did TV, Fred. Remember? Yes, you did, I, did. Uh, talk of I, the I did Talk of the Town yep. uh, on KTN. Yes, indeed. All right, with Jacqueline Thorn. Yes. And uh, I had an opportunity to interview Barry White. No. Yeah. The, the Godfather of, <laughs> of black music. Yes. Yes. What was he like? That was way back 1975. Uh, no, 1995, sorry, mm. when he came to Kenya. Wow. Yes. Barry White. Oh. That guy had a voice. Girls were. I don't want to go there. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Uh, it's wow. Been, it's been fun. I mean, working in this industry. Yeah. And you get paid. And I you. don't work anyway. No. You say you're always no. having fun. Yes. I keep on asking how unwise Waruru Washira can be. You know, that's yeah. my advice. Yes. And, and I ask, how unwise can you get? Yes. To pay me for entertaining myself? <laughs> Every weekend. Okay, Waruru Washira yeah. is not my boss. He's the boss of the boss of the boss of my boss. Uh -huh. Okay? Yes. Because after Waruru Washira, there is Fred Afune, uh -huh. uh, there is Werumburu, there is Joyce Gaturu. And far down the line, I happen to be somewhere there just enjoying myself. Having fun. Having fun. Getting paid. And getting paid for it. How lucky can you get? Damn. Is Sam Chalet listening? No, I don't know. <laughs> they pay you too? No, um, um. <laughs> <laughs> they pay you <laughs> for coming here to <laughs> do all yeah. sorts of <laughs> jobs. <laughs> they, they pay me to do that. <laughs> How can they? <laughs> it's a crime. <laughs> Can't they pay the cameraman? <laughs> Anyway. Oh, Fred. So, yeah. so uh, I, I really enjoy this stuff. Mm, obviously you I've do. I've enjoyed myself, and I thank God for it all the time. Yeah, Fred, earlier on, you and I were talking about the golden era, the 70s, the yes. 80s. I mean, you know, musically, yeah. Jeff, the golden era, forget the 1960s yeah. during James Brown, mm. you know, yeah. and others. Talk about the 70s during groups like middle of the road you know oh, middle of the road samson and delilah long long time ago oh yeah yes yeah you know and then people like uh people like uh, bonnie m bonnie m do you remember bonnie m yeah bonnie m was here in 19 was 79 it no 79 can't remember i remember and some uh, and some madoka was there was the was the MC? No. At KICC, I was there. Come on. Yeah. 
And then, uh, and then of course, there was Bobby McNary. Marvin Gaye. You hold remember on, Marvin Gaye? Hold on, hold on. Let's Bobby McNary. Oh, Barry White. Yeah? Uh, uh, Marvin, Marvin Gaye. Gaye. Marvin Gaye. Yes, what bad a, boy. What about Bunny M? I tell you. Bon guy, Bonny M. He's crazy uh, like a fool. You know, a he's fool. crazy like a fool. What about Daddy, Daddy Cool? <laughs> Yeah. That was Bobby Farrell, Bobby, you Bobby know, Maxwell, Lizzie yeah. Michelle, yeah. Maisie Williams, oh. Maisie Barrett. Did you meet them? Yeah, I met yeah. them. Yes, I did. They were good, man. Oh, Ma Baker. Ma Baker, oh. the baddest oh. drama in town. Oh. Yeah. And yes. of course, uh, brown girl in the ring. Cha la 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 la. <laughs> Jesus. Man. That's how old we are, man. Yeah. <laughs> Those were great yeah. Yeah. days. Man. That was the 70s. 70s. Uh, Abba, when, don't when, when, Abba. when when there was Abba was good. Can you hear the song, Fernando? Fernando. Oh my goodness! Powerful. Powerful. Take it easy. I'll tell you what's wrong. <laughs> yeah. Take a chance. Oh. Take a chance. Take a chance. Take a chance. Take a chance. You know, yeah. those were great songs yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They were. They were. And then and then of course there were now, you know, people like. Uh, uh, Rufus Thomas, you know, doing the funky penguin. Yes. There were people like Isaac Hayes, Isaac. the Black Moses, Oof. the only guy who could intimidate the king of rock. That was uh, that Elvis. was Elvis Presley himself. Yeah, but Black Moses walks in on stage. Oh. Are you serious? Those were, and of course yeah. Diana Ross. Dennis yes, Ross, Donna Summer. Yeah, Donna Summer. Oh, yeah. Oh, those were great. Gladys Knight and, and the, the Pips. Pips. Midnight yeah. Train to Georgia. Yes. So Ooh. all those fellows, uh, including uh, uh, Whitney Houston's the auntie. Yeah. What was her name? Uh, uh, Cicely. No, I'm. Yeah, I'm, the, the, no, the, the no. one who was doing. Uh, her aunt. Uh, who was doing uh, a, a TV show at the same time? Yes. I forget the name. Yeah, yeah, we'll yeah all those people were well, very popular. And then come the 80s. Oh, 80s. Now, the 80s was a cliffhanger. Man. Because that's when Michael Jackson came out of the Jackson 5. Mm -hmm. He came off the wall. He came off the wall. Wow. Wanna be starting something. <laughs> Wanna be starting <laughs> something. <laughs> yeah. PYT, pretty young thing. Pretty young thing. Yeah, you remember all yes. those? Yes. And, and, and it was real good. Lionel Cause, Richie. Because it was Lionel Richie. You remember 1984, mm. Los Angeles Games? Yes. Uh, Olympics? Yes. When he was doing uh, All Night Long. All Night Long. Uh, all Night. Sante Ping Zimo, young. Uh, that was good. That was good. Yeah? Oof. That was the beginning yeah. of the infiltration or innovation of American music into and then of course now Whitney Houston herself. Oh, golden voice. Yes. Golden voice. Fred, I want to yeah. take a break, come back. I'll talk about your African influences as well. Now I will tell you, that is now the base. From Franco. That, yeah. From Franco to Tabule to yes. Kanda Bongo yes. Man. All of that. Yes. Billy Abel. Yeah. Uh -huh. Moto Kamapasina. Moto Zaidi. <laughs> Pass your maca. <laughs> <laughs> I told you. Inspiration Thursday with the living legend himself, Fred Obachi Machoka, the blackest man in black. Where did that phrase come from? Because uh, everybody used to feel intimidated during those days because they used to talk about Black Sunday, Black whatever. They could be calling today a Black Thursday. You understand? Yeah. And it, everything black seemed to be like the unwanted thing. Yes. And I said, I'm black and I have no complaints. Oh, apologies. And, and apologies. Tell me how you used yeah. to say it. Go on, say how you used to say I'm it. I'm the blackest boy in black Africa. Now I'm a black man. Okay? <laughs> that time I was the blackest boy yeah. in black Africa. T B M I B A. <laughs> T-B-M-I-B-A. That's right. That's too many uh, <laughs> letters. <laughs> What a man! At Fred Omachoka, I'm at Krenanga Jeff, the hashtag. You call it what you want. Fred, Roga Roga, sign your juice, sign your tops. Yes. Go on. Tweet it. Call in. It's Moto Zaidi. Moto Kamapasi Azamani. Yes. Yakita. Yamaka. <laughs> <laughs> JKL takes a break. Oh my. We get paid for this, imagine. Yes. I can't Wamai. understand. I'm still.
doing research <laughs> to find out why we get paid for doing this. This. Back in a moment. <laughs> Oh, my. <laughs> uh -huh. Hey. Okay.